Hey everybody, welcome back to GWN. I am Knock, your host. So, over the last, I don't know, several months here, I've been talking a lot about what I think is the future of attacks on the builder base. And I tell you guys all the time that you really need to customize your attack strategy for the base that you're going against. I had, a, uh, had an attack the other day that it was just perfect, a perfect example of this, and I thought I'd go ahead and share that with you. So, let me go ahead and launch this replay real quick. Okay, here we go. Now, I want you to take a look at this base. And I'm sorry to, to Saddam, I'm picking on him a little bit here. <laughs> but this base, when you look at it, it screams two different layouts. The upper half of the base is very much a, a minion drop shimmy kind of base. It's what you'll see on a, a ton of different bases of this type, of this box type, if you will, that is just great for coming at with beta minions and drop ships. But the bottom of the base it screams cannon carts. So you could use a, you know, a Pekka cart or a Jai cart or, I mean, if you want to, a Jai Bach or whatever. But looking at this base, when I saw this, I said, wait a minute, I see a very custom attack strategy that could be used on this. And that's exactly what I did. So let's go ahead and hit the replay and we'll watch it. And you'll see how I broke this one down. And again, this is, I believe, the future of attacks for the more advanced levels of the builder base. The higher level players already do this, so it, it, this, this is nothing new to them, of course. But to a lot of the players who are still coming up through the ranks, mo most of them are really focused more on the attack strategies. And if you use the strats, they work fine until you get to the higher level play where you really need to start thinking about exactly what each individual defense or each zone of defense is doing in a particular base layout. And that's what's nice about this particular base, um, even though it is more or less a box base, is that you've got two or three solid defensive zones in here. You know, the two sides to uh, take any kind of foot traffic, if you will, the bottom box, and then that kind of upper middle box with the, with the apron that goes around it as well. These are all different design components for a, uh, for a base. And, uh, you know, Saddam uses them very well here. Uh, coming at the top with a minion drop, and then coming at the bottom with a P.E.K.K.A. cart, totally dismantles the base. It, it breaks down the different zones and then uses their weaknesses against them. That's what you want to do when you run one of these attacks. And in this particular case, I ended up with a 98% two-star, which is a heartbreaker that I don't, I didn't get that three-star. But that's all right. It's, it's a level 7-8 defender, so, yeah, you know, not too terrible bad. Uh, the, the end result was pretty good, and I'm certainly happy with it. These are the kinds of attacks that you want to start working your way toward as you get closer and closer to a max design on your base. The, like I said, the attack strats, they work great. They're not going anywhere. You know, whether you're a, a Bombarian Carts guy, or you're a Minion Drops guy, or you're a, a Pekka Carts gal, or whatever. It doesn't matter. They're, they're all still good, but some of these, these tougher bases you'll find you can get a much higher percentage if you customize your attack specifically to the base design like, you know, you see in this particular one. All right, so there you have it. Just a quick video. I wanted to share that before the replays end up uh, uh, getting removed from the servers. And uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please, uh, please hit the like down below. Subscribe if you're new. And uh, thanks for sticking around to the end of the video. I'll be back with the weekend war recap here a little bit later on as well. Y'all take care. Keep on clashing. Bye-bye.